Hey, everybody. Ah, it's a great day, and it's Friday, and it's a three-day weekend, Memorial Day weekend. I'm super pumped. Um, probably end up doing a lot of, uh, oh, look at that. Look at that guy put his hand in front of the, <laughs> Nick, help. <laughs> anyway, we're on site here. Um, I'm taking it to the job, the deck job that I'm working on. It's, it's one of my really, oh geez, I just can't, I just can't hold the camera straight, can I? I just can't do it. <laughs> well, hopefully the content makes up for it. But anyway, we're here at uh, one of my best customers' house, um, and uh, he's doing a deck. <laughs> I'm gonna get centered. I can't center it. I'm I'm horrible. Anyway, um, yeah. So that's kind of what's going on. Um, he tore his old deck down and uh, he contracted out the new framing and contracted out the tile that's going down on the deck. Yes, I said porcelain tile, three quarters of an inch thick, two foot by two foot. That's some weight. Um, and it's a system that, you know. I have no idea what the engineers were thinking when they made this system, but it's what we have. Um, the framers didn't do a very good job, so that's an issue. Let me just put, you know, you guys want to read my palm? <laughs> I have a very long life of being a bad cameraman. Yeah, indeed. Um, but, uh, so anyway, here we are. Um, this walkway has been here for a while. Um, and it stepped up to a cedar deck. Um, but, uh, so it stopped right about here and then here's where the construction started. And so, yeah, look at these buttes. Look at these buttes. These tiles are gorgeous and, and it's a good design. Um, I wish he had called me in from the beginning. Um, to ride herd on the quote unquote carpenters that built this thing, but we won't go into that. I'm not going to tear him down. He likes to be the general contractor and I'm like general contractor, um, junior, uh, unscrewer upper of things. Um, and that's just the way he likes to roll. And we've had a good relationship for, oh my goodness, four or five years. And he's been very gracious to me and I've gotten a lot of work from him. I'm very grateful to him. Um, so yeah, we got a little sunken area over here and these things that look like bottle caps are led lights, um, that go around the whole perimeter and light up the steps. And so it's been quite a battle because, uh, when you're doing something like this, um, the, the joists have to be dead flat. And there's a lot of joists that aren't dead flat. Um, and so it's been an issue. There's been a lot of shims going on. Uh, there's been a lot of workmen that don't understand square, straight, and level um, in and out of here. Um, but that's kind of my job is to coordinate everything and get this heading on the right track. Um, so that's, that's what I do. That's what he likes me doing. Um, and so that's, that's good. Um, I don't really think as, you know, I don't let a lot of my customers do that because a, most of my customers don't have, uh, money to, uh, change their minds. He changes his mind a lot. I can build something and come back the next day and he'll be like, guess what? And I'll be like, ah, you changed it, didn't you? Um, but, uh, so be it. Um, like I said, he's been very good to me. Um, so here's the program. Here's what's going on. Um, we've got some wacky, wacky cuts. Um, the guys that set the tile worked from the house out, which is a bad idea. You generally do your border first and then work from your border in. Um, there's an upper deck, um, which has to be investigated a little bit. Um, but, uh, yeah, this is the job site. 
and look at that view. You see those big high power lines? That's where the Missouri River is. There's deer all over here. Um, back when things were on lockdown, there were eagles flying over here. Um, it's really a great place. I enjoy working here. And I love peace and quiet. And working. Um, so anyway, we've, we've pretty much redone this whole perimeter and glued these down with uh, a heavy-duty polyurethane caulk. And the thing about these perimeter pieces is you have to have those wires dead straight down or it messes with how the tile sits and the light won't go down because the lights are just about an eighth of an inch too thick. If they were flush with the bottom of the tile, it would be no problemo, but it was a problemo. And so I've started here and gone around the whole darn deck and the reason those are up is there's a steel stair, steel powder coated staircase going down there. Um, but uh, this is what we got going on. Um, taking care of all the tippy tippies and shimming stuff up and getting ready for grout. Um, this is the holy 10 foot straight edge. Um, to a concrete worker, it would be a screed but I went up to one of my suppliers and picked out the straightest 10 foot straight edge that I could find and have used that. It's been an incredible tool to have. Um, you put a four foot level on that and you create a 10 foot level. And for plumbing big things up, it's good. These are the powder coated posts for this puppy. And what in the heck is this you might ask? Well. I'll show you. These are going to bolt onto the side after the side is trimmed out. And we'll have to establish an elevation, but those are going to bolt to the side of the deck. And then those holes are going to have to be lined up. And there's going to be, I'm telling you, the camera thing. Anyway, back to the posts. Oh, gee back to the posts with the holes. So those posts will get mounted to the side, the whole, whole side of the deck, all the way around. And then we have reels of aircraft cable, stranded cable, that are gonna act as the balusters. So you'll literally be able to walk right up to the edge of this and it's gonna be cool. So anyway, that's what's going on. And I gotta go, stop gabbing and get to work. Um, I might have some GoPro footage of this job. Um, we'll just see. My work right now is coming to an end because there's a polymeric sand gonna be used as grout. And it has a synthetic, it's sand, it's silica sand and it has a, some sort of bunch of chemicals in it that um, are gonna tighten this puppy down and make it good. So say the engineers. Um, so, adios, just letting you know what's going on. Talk to you soon.